Happy New Year, everyone! It's 2020, and I know this is time you and people have finished nursing school. Congratulations on finishing the probably hardest two to four years of your life. This is the time of year when people are preparing to take the NCLEX, which, if you didn't know, the NCLEX is the national examination test that determines whether or not you can actually practice as a registered nurse. And so, this video is going to be all about how you can pass the NCLEX on your first try. Let's get into the video right now. Tip number one for studying for the NCLEX. You don't want to study in bulk over a short period of time. You want to study over a longer period of time. I started studying for the NCLEX about a year before I actually took it. And I studied a little bit each day. So that way I was able to not cram and I could actually soak in the information before I took the test. So when I took practice questions and, pra and practice NCLEX questions, it wasn't like I was just regurgitating information, I actually knew the information. So, studying over a longer period of time and not cramming at the end, like right before you take the test, is my first tip. Second tip is when you study, use mnemonics. When I went to take the NCLEX, the, one of the reviews I did, there's 20 million NCLEX reviews. There's Kaplan, there's ATI, there's Sylvia Rayfield, there's a bunch of others. I did Kaplan and Sylvia Rayfield. Sylvia Rayfield really hit home on mnemonics. Like, to remember content of chest pains, EKGs, lab values, electrolytes, medications. And so Finding mnemonics that work for you, the way you can remember the information and actually apply the content to what the question is being asked will help you in the long run. Tip number three is to study by teaching. So what I mean by this is after you've learned the material, if you can teach it to somebody else, then if you can teach it, then you know it well enough to take the test for it. Because if you can teach it to someone else, then that means you really have it ingrained into your mind that I know this information. Tip number four is to practice, 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 practice. So you should at least be doing 50 NCLEX practice questions a day up until you take the test. And NCLEX is just one big how to take a test test so that's why if you can take multiple sets of questions or NCLEX style questions before you take the test and know how they're asking you the content then you can actually apply the content in a way that makes sense my fifth tip on how to pass NCLEX is to relax and rest do not, I repeat, do not do any questions or look at any content or any NCLEX review, bo re review book right before you take the test. Because then it's going to get in your mind and it's like you have 20 million things running through your mind. You're not going to go know which way is up. You're going to get very, very confused. And once you, you're going to just be anxious going into your test versus if you study for about six months up until you take the test the day before you just relax and do something that you want to do you go into the test more calm and level-headed and you can focus better and that concludes the video on how to pass the NCLEX on your first try if you have any other questions about NCLEX or about nursing school or about nursing in general please leave a comment down below and I will get back to you as quickly as possible but in the meantime don't forget to like this video and subscribe if you want more nursing and new grad nurse content and I will talk to y'all in my next video y'all have a good day bye